the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's PSG, they face Manchester United and it's live on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Marquinhos plays alongside Sergio Ramos in central defence. Vitor Ferreira starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Lionel Messi. for Manchester United. David De Gea between the posts. Luke Shaw starts with Aaron Wan-Bissaka in the fullback positions. Christian Eriksen plays with Casemiro in the center of the pitch. And the lead striker today is Anthony Martial. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Neymar and return to Messi Hakimi and here's Fabian and Neymar must be well not making life difficult for the keeper at all a wide attempt Fernandes on to Juan Bissaka Casemiro and return to Martial and a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened Fabian he's got the right idea with that pass Oh, but just unable to unlock the defence. But I think it's fair to say, Stuart, Neymar can do just about anything out there on the pitch. What in particular do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. And they find a gap in the defence. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Lionel Messi and attempting the through ball and nearly the ideal ball but a good piece of defending oh and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk now what's the referee going to do next and the early shower this is going to be a real test of their metal well it's a straight red and rightly so but how will they replace him they've got to reorganize now PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front
Rashford. Really vital interception here. Sustained pressure and they have the ball now. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Nordi Mukiele. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Could take the lead. Well, it was close to the target, but close isn't good enough, really. This is Varan. Lisandro Martinez. Eriksson. And Rashford. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. He could pick out a teammate. Rashford. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Verratti. Mbappe. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Mbappe. Fabian. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Playing it in. Well, the clearance half hearted. And in the end, no damage done. Martial. Aaron Wan Bissaka. And back with Martial. Ferreira. Plenty of support here. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Can they convert? And offside, just as he was ready to pounce. Anthony Martial. A failure to keep the ball there by Paris Saint-Germain. A really top-notch piece of defending. Minch. Neymar. Here's Fabian. Verratti. Mbappé! Champions League final. Well, let's see this again. What a pass this is from Verratti. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Bruno Fernandes. And showing fine vision. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. 
Well, as you can see again, Fernandez plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Marquinhos. Vitor Ferreira. Neymar. Oh, tight offside decision. But the flag does go up. Neymar. Mbappe. Fabian! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. And he ran it well defensively. Mukiele. Magnificent defending. And Neymar. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well, he had the measure of it, the goalkeeper. How about the short corner? Mbappe. Marquinhos. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. The corner kicks keep on coming. And the short option preferred. Mbappe. Casemiro lost the ball. Anthony. Bruno Fernandes. Eriksen. Casemiro. What a save. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. Well, PSG get the ball moving again. How will they respond? Ramos. Vitor Ferreira. Oh, he's given the ball away. Martial. Here's Eriksen. Opportunity. Nicely saved. And deciding to go short with this one. Martial. Rashford! And there it is! A goal! I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Well, here we can see it again. Normally I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent.
So back underway, 3-1 the score. Ferreira. Neymar. Fabian. Back to Neymar. Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark now here at Wembley. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Bruno Fernandes. Surely! Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, I must say, Bruno Fernandes having a great game out there. He's been quite the handful for those defenders. Well, what a display from him. Lots of touches, some great passes and an assist. He's been absolutely brilliant today. Vitor Ferreira. And unable to keep possession. Martial. And a goal! What a magnificent display! It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So the action underway once more. And it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Verratti. Here's Fabian. Neymar. And Fabian, Neymar preparing the inside route. Manchester United recovering possession well. Anthony Martial. Bruno Fernandes has it. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes. Promising looking ball. Casimiro, the end product just wasn't there. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, it fizzled out. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, it might be. And the keeper getting across to stop it. Short corner here. Martial. Now with Rashford. And very deftly cut out. Bruno Fernandes. A glorious chance. Another goal. The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Go for 
a glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Neymar playing with purpose and control. Extremely sloppy in possession. Neymar. Mbappe. Nicely timed tackle. Fabian. Vitor Ferreira. Well, very effective play in possession. Mbappe. Fabian. Soler. And the ball is loose. And he clears it out of harm's way. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Well, making high pressing work for them here. And PSG will have a throw in. Mbappe. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, a lovely ball. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Nordi Mukiele. And Soler. Ramos. Verratti. Ferreira. He'll take this on. Oh, that's top notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Anthony. Bruno Fernandes has it. Beghorst. Here's Casemiro. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Here's a change for Manchester United. To be replaced by number 20, Diogo Dalot. Soler and Soler Mbappe well he made sure there was absolutely no way through Bruno Fernandes well, not the best clearance Eriksson, he's given it straight to the opposition. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. They need to get bodies back. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, as we approach full time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. Save, but still a chance. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, let's take another look at this. From the attacking point of view, everything is right. The shot across the goalkeeper making it difficult for him. Players coming in for the rebound. It's an excellent goal. And the keeper could do nothing about it. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now.
Well, we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Fabian. Verratti. Well, closed down straight away. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? A significant block by Ramos. How about the short corner? Oh, good save. Substitution, for the Substitution it is for PSG. Number 17, Vitor Ferreira. Coming onto the pitch. Number 14, Juan Bernat. Short corner favoured. Bruno Fernandes. An important interception. And we've entered the final five minutes. Good visualisation and execution. And a PSG corner. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, they can keep possession now. Mbappe. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact, and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. Goal for Paris Saint-Germain. Number six, Marco Verratti. Malassia. Bruno Fernandes has it. And that's an important intervention. And continues his run. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Ericsson. Now with Rashford. Oh, tremendous goalkeeping. And now we find out it was offside anyway. Really effective shielding under pressure. Bernat. Verratti now. Out of play. PSG throw in forthcoming. Mbappe. Oh, surely. Oh, dearie me. We know he's capable of much better from that position. And now the whistle they all wanted to hear. Manchester United have painted the Champions League red. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond.
Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester United. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. Manchester United are the winners of the UEFA Champions League.